Conservators at the Hong Kong Palace Museum, which opens in July, are preparing to receive exhibits that will be arriving from Beijing in the coming weeks. Special equipment will be used to protect the priceless works of art from the humidity. Joanna Ho reports. The Hong Kong Palace Museum is preparing to receive more than 900 works of art before it opens in July, while officials in Beijing are checking the condition of the pieces before sending them to Hong Kong. Two conservators at the museum in the West Kowloon Cultural District are setting up specific display furniture for their storage and exhibition. Lu Zhichao is an expert on Chinese painting and calligraphy, and Jesse Liang has an interest in archaeological relics and ceramics. The ceramics, bronzes, and paper-based artifacts such as calligraphy require special treatment because of Hong Kong's humid weather. For the, um, the bronze, it needs a well, well dry environment because uh, water is a very important uh, you know, um, component for the uh, deterioration of the metal. So we just provide a very dry environment for the metal. The conservator said the hot weather in summer is not the biggest challenge as the city's temperature range across different seasons is relatively small. Apart from demonstrating the use of the hygrometer to measure humidity and the thermometer, Lu and Liang showed the other items they use. These include brushes imported from the mainland and two lacquer tables, one of which was made by a craftsman in Yangzhou. The lacquer tables are specifically important for the conservation of Chinese silk-based and paper-based works of art. The conservator said the red tone can help them check different layers inside the calligraphies and paintings. The two said they were proud to be involved in the project and urged people to visit the museum as soon as it is opened to appreciate the exhibits sent from the Palace Museum in Beijing. Joanna Ho, HKIBC.